Another great place is the supermarket or any, you know, Walgreens, any drugstore, any store you go into, always keep your eyes peeled because you're going to see coupons everywhere. Um, the first that we're going to discuss is these are like a little booklet that we found in the store. Right inside the doorway. Just wait until you start off, guys, with like an Easter egg hunt for coupon books. I love it. I you know, and I stick them right inside of my binder, or you know, I just have a little pile that I leave with, and then I go home and sort them. This was um, a little booklet that has, you know, fifteen dollars worth of coupons inside. I've used a few, but uh, there was fifteen dollars inside this booklet, and you know, I was just sitting there right next to the drug store area, you know, by the pharmacy. Uh, this is a Walgreens coupon booklet. Right when you walk in, again, this changes every month. They're going to put out a different booklet. And uh, this is another little booklet that we saw at Publix. And this is for their Earth Day, and it's, you know, filled with lots of great coupons inside of it. And you guys, when these new booklets come out, like Walgreens, like she said, every month, Publix just randomly has a few, we'll let you know. We'll put it on our website. We'll let you know what's inside of it. And believe me, once the word's out, they go quick. So if you're going to the store, Grab them, grab them, grab them. I'm um, talking about internet a second ago. The internet has so many different resources out there, not only to help with our matchups, but to get the coupons to you. There's so many different kind of internet coupons that we can get to you. Um, here's one. You know, the internet coupons. There's so many resources out there, and we will give you those resources. We have a whole list printed on there, as well as if something new pops up and there's a new resource, we're going to let you know. So. Stay up, stay with our site, you know, we're something we post all day long to let you know. Um, some other different types are, um, this is a product hanging, and that's what we call it, a product hanging. This was, you know, it's a little sticky, it was just hanging right off of um, some laundry detergent. It's a $5 off car wash. You're going to see these um, a lot on cleaning products and often on wine as well. And you're going to just see us refer to these as product hanging. And, you know, it's a coupon on the back, a little barcode, they're going to scan it. Um, another That's kind. It. Yeah. Um, another kind is, oh, here, what this one? I like this one. This is actually Kylie's favorite. You have to <laughs> rate them if you're in the store with her. These are peelies. Um, you'll find these a lot on, especially like toothpaste and soap, things like that. Here's a shout peely. You peel it off. Guys, if it's not on sale, put it in your binder. Save it. You know what we teach in class. Remember that. Um, Here's one on Miracle Whip mayonnaise. Here's one that was on Old Spice. So get your peelies. Keep your eyes peeled for peelies. The thing with peelies, and this is a good example. This one's really clean. These are all clean. This one, very sticky. It was, you know, it's really hard to tear off. <laughs> um, but it, you know, it's really stuck on there well. Go ahead and try to take that off if you can, or snip it off because you don't want to throw that in with your binder and have it get stuck to a barcode and then, you know, when you tear it off, this coupon is ruined. I've done that a few times, and it's a bummer. Me too, because these are money. Remember, yeah. money. <laughs> money, money, money. Um, here's one. Tear pads. Remember the tear pads that are all over a lot of my product displays? It says, you know, save one a dollar on any one. Some will say, save 50 cents now. Now doesn't mean anything to us. We just know that now it's a coupon for us. Thank you. So, <laughs> look for your tear pads. Um, just like tear pads, you're going to find these, and these came from a blinky machine. These are the machines that are set up usually in the middle of the aisles, and just like tear pads, they're, you know, tear pads can be in the aisle or they can be on a display. These are typically either on the door, like in the freezer section, or right in the aisle um, throughout the store. And, you know, they spit one out. Typically, you know, it waits a few seconds or you walk away and it's motion detected. It comes back and it spits another one out. Um, yeah, just like any other coupon. These are the things that kids like. You'll see them all over because my kids have been there and pulled them all out. Sorry. Um, another thing, um, this is a store coupon I got from Kroger out of my book. Store coupon. I've got public store coupon. Um, this is a Catalina. This is kind of print out at the end when you, when you register, you're going to get a register tape and you're going to get a Catalina. It's a small machine. Not all stores have them. Most of the grocery stores do. Um, these are great. A lot of people walk off and leave these hanging there, and that's when I go by and say thank you very much. I mean, this one is a dollar off Cottonelle toilet paper, and it's a manufacturer coupon. So these are great. Don't walk away and leave these. Don't wad them up and throw them away. These are great coupons. Sometimes with Catalina, it's going to be, you know, dollar off. It could be a 10% off your whole purchase, or it could be, you know, I got one that was 20% off, like a Payless shoe store, shoe store. So I wasn't even in that store. I was at the grocery store. So 
always grab them. You have no idea what you're going to get. Or, you know, sometimes there are Catalina deals, so you may know what you're going to get if you're following those deals. And we do have the Catalina campaigns on our website as well because there are campaigns. Kraft ran a campaign a couple months ago for every, like, $10 in Kraft products you purchased, you got a $2 Catalina to spit out. So there's different campaigns as well for the Catalina coupon. Um, there are two different uh, categories that coupons are going to fall under. Usually it's a store coupon or a manufacturer coupon. And with everything that we discuss, whether it's a Blinky, a TerraPad, um, something you found in the store, the inserts, the mailers, they can contain both, especially if it came directly from the store. It could contain, you know, this could have store coupons or it could have manufacturer coupons. And the way to tell that it's a manufacturer coupon, probably going to be a little hard to read, but, you know, both of these have barcodes. This one up here, this is the barcode that is scanned at the store. Up top here, you're going to see that it says manufacturer coupon. Down here, this is a Target coupon, and that Target coupon actually says Target web coupon. It does not say manufacturer coupon. Here's a CVS. It says CVS coupon. Um, I had another one. This one's a Publix coupon, and it says store coupon. All stores kind of have them printed differently, but you want to pay attention to your wording. Some stores and most stores that do print out their own coupons also will print out manufacturer coupons as well. Target is a great example. On their website, you're going to be able to print store coupons and manufacturer coupons. All of them are going to have the Target logo on them. If it's a manufacturer coupon, and you'll know because it will say manufacturer coupon up here, you can use it at any store that accepts manufacturer coupons. Just because it has their logo does not mean you have to use it in that store. So a store coupon, in-store, as long as it's a manufacturer coupon, even with a logo, you can use that anywhere. Kroger, Kroger books that come to your house in the mail do that a lot. They'll have a little Kroger icon on the bottom that's manufacturer. And remember, courtesy is everything when you're couponing. Just, you know, if you have a question, slightly point out, no, it says manufacturer at the top. It's, it's fine. Let's see, I think that's all of the different types of coupons in different places yeah. to find them. If something pops up to us, we will let you know. We'll bring it to you. Stay tuned on freewheelhouse.net.